About 45 minutes south of Hartford is another great Connecticut city, New Haven, nicknamed the Elm City because there used to be tons of elm trees on the green. New Haven is also a port city. That means it's built next to the water to allow boats to visit and bring supplies. The city is located on New Haven Harbor, which is on Long Island Sound, and that flows to the Atlantic Ocean. Marking the entrance to New Haven Harbor is the Five Mile Point Lighthouse. It is named that because it's five miles from downtown New Haven. This lighthouse helped guide sailors into port for decades, but in 1877, the light was extinguished. Five Mile Point Light is now a part of the Lighthouse Point Park, which also includes the Lighthouse Point Carousel. Another place that New Haven is known for is Yale University, one of New Haven's many colleges. Founded in 1701, it's the third oldest university in the whole country. Many famous people have attended Yale, including Eli Whitney, the inventor of the cotton gin, and Presidents George W. Bush and Bill Clinton. High above the city of New Haven is East Rock, which formed 200 million years ago. On top of the rock is the Soldiers and Sailors Monument, which was built in 1887. This statue can be seen for miles around. Families can visit East Rock, hike the trails, and even look out at New Haven from high above. All around Connecticut, you'll find amazing places like Hartford and New Haven. And thanks to Drone Ranger, we'll be able to show you them all. Next time on All Around Connecticut, we'll head to Waterbury, also known as the Brass City. And we'll share why it got this unique name.